there. No GPS needed. And it's above water. Tim Harold. Good thing I came out today. We're just going to pull this out of here. We're not even going to change anything. You know, I can raise them, but this water level may come up even more. So, I really don't want to do that. Yes, sir, e dog gang. Going to get us to see some gators today. We're going to see some gators, I promise you. We're going to bring it to you. We're going to get those gators. We're going to see some action. A lot of water. A lot of water now. Water's high. Roads are wet. Roads are muddy. And those gators are going to be walking and talking. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. South Florida wild man's always do I ever not impress. Do I never do I ever do I ever let you down? Nope. Check the GPS. We're almost there. We got we got pending rain coming. It's gonna be nasty. But uh, it's a great day to check those critter camps. Gators are gonna be walking and talking. Maybe some otters. When it gets wet like this, you never know what you're gonna see. Never know. Maybe skunk ape, Sasquatch, Bigfoot. Who knows? South Florida wild man, bringing you some hot gator action from the South Florida swamps. No doubt to doubt it. We'll leave you alone. Ain't no sun today. Ain't no sunshine when I'm gone. All right? You take care now. Oh, he's moving around. Listen to that. That's my sound. That's the sound of critters. We got frogs, crickets. I heard some gators already, saw one gator, and I heard some others, and we just got here, and who knows what we're going to see, but we're going to take you back to another Bobby Woman Photography Adventure, South Florida Wild Man in the house, we're going through some bush, let's get it on. As we get deeper and deeper. You can see it's getting wetter and wetter because this is just a low-lying area. It's an old slough. That's an old cypress head and slough. And uh, we just got to be on guard for gators. That's the biggest thing. And the mosquitoes are quadruple. Look at all this hog written. Um, the mosquitoes are quadruple of what they were before. So I'm not moving any cameras unless I have to. But you can see water level definitely all over coming up.
I think that's better than it was. Better than it has to be. Okay. One more. Yeah, we'll leave it right there. I like it. You know, it's for gators. So many people may not, but I do. And it's definitely mosquitoes. And I'm out of here. Say goodbye, mosquitoes. That was close. Hundred percent. All right, we're looking good. This swamp or slough will really be good. I, I really do believe it.
This is what I'm telling you. So this is overflow right here. I, matter of fact, I'll bring them all out. This is this is crazy. We got to go right there. Wish me luck and Godspeed. All right, all right. Hold on. Well, let me go back and put my GPS away. Sure as hell don't want to get that drenched. Oh man, see where the water line came up? See his log here? Shit, stay by the cypress, Bob. Stay by the cypress. All right, this is where I gotta go, right here. So, higher ground will help me out. We got five pound bass swimming around me. You want to know why gators come in here and otters? All right. Let's make it back here. Mm. Oh, I got to get out there. All right. I got to go out here. Going for a walk, ladies and gentlemen. Nice leisurely walk in the swamp. That's waist deep. No doubt about it. If I let it get any deeper, my camera will be done. You know? So we're going. It might be done already. This one was over right. Yep, probably. It was right. 
we got all these logs. Remember these logs were in front of my camera? We should be right there. No GPS needed. And it's above water. Tim Harold. Good thing I came out today. Spinning around. So I got logs all through here that I was overlooking. And then over here, that's where the deer were coming through. And then that's how close I was to the water line. All right. It was on. We're still on. We got 60 pounds. Oh, yeah. We got 60 pounds of backpack. We're going to sink down. What I took. Come here. Come here. Listen to your father when he's talking to you. When, when dad says don't put them out in, in, a, in a woolly swamp that's going to fill in. Are you cray cray? Man, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. I'm just playing with you guys. Believe me, if I was scared, I wouldn't be out here. Ooh, that was a hole. All the way to my, well, you know. I just look for moccasins on top. The ones on the bottom are going to get my boots. I'm walking too fast. That was a stump. We're going to, uh, we're going to serpentine. Same way we came in. Hope, hopefully we didn't troll up any gators in our backwash. Oh, that was another stump. You can't see them. And you definitely can join them. That was another stump. All right, we're going to... And there are logs and stumps. I'm hitting my knees. You just keep watching ahead. I'm looking for high ground and no bubbles. It's beautiful. It really is. It really is. I'll give you the bird's eye view. This is the low view coming out. Good thing. Good thing we came out, folks. So, my camera was on that tree right there. You can see where the water line is. And, uh, I don't know. Maybe we did get some gators in here. Maybe we got nothing. But, I know this. I know there's stumps that I'm falling all over. Well, that could have been a gator. So, this knotty, or that one. See this knot right here? That's where I didn't want to come in at. That's why I told you. I don't like that area, because that's usually the deepest part. Anything that's holding that kind of foliage. And I just didn't like that. And if you remember from the camera over here, the gator went in right over in there. So they love this kind of stuff, vegetation. So we're gonna come around. This is where I took a little siesta right here. Right here. Last time in the video. You can see where the water's come up now and it's all filled in. This was just mud. This was all mud. I didn't want to come in there that way. I just didn't want to because there was too much vegetation. I didn't want to cut through that. So what I did was I cut some, I just clipped a path right through here. It wasn't easy, but I, I think it was. Uh, yeah, yeah, I came right over the top. Let's see. Either over the top or underneath. There's only two ways about it. This is why I didn't have it on when I first came in, because it was tough going. Vines, oh, here's where it is. So you can get lost in here, and you can definitely trip over everything. Nice little, I broke a little fern path here, you know. I'd rather be on high ground, all right, than down in there in Woolly Swamp. So we just cut, cut through here. Then we're gonna take a siesta. How'd you like that? How you like me now? It was brutal. 
It was brutal. And you can see that uh, punch bowl filled up. I told you freaks I'd go out. Lisa Bayless is not going to be happy. She does not like me to go in the swamp. Nor does Karen. Nor does Tommy. Nor does Howie. Nor does my mom. Oh, God. My dad, Linda. Uh, that's about it. You friends, you want to see me go out there. You know you do. You are freaks. Freaks of nature. You're like, you're like, hey, Bobby, can you take us out there? Show us what it's like? Yeah, well, I just did. All right? Fun. It is. It really is. You got to be aware of your surroundings. You do. You have to be aware of your surroundings. Though I'd like to go with more people than just myself. Tim Harold does it by himself. Group of Toes does it by himself. There's a lot of... Uh, Frederick, he does it by himself. You know, everybody does. So, well, not everybody, but only the foolish people. Right where I want to be, baby. Right in nature. Wouldn't want to have it any other way. You know what? Well, I, like I said, if I'm going to go, it'll be out here in my terms or in big gators terms you never know bobby one more photography we're winding this episode up Woo! might call it the punch bowl the punch bowl overflowed bobby one more photography at youtube instagram and facebook check me out or don't check me out it's all good i love y'all i love bringing this from here in here to you guys in there you know from my camera to your computer to your cell phone to your tv whatever i am that's where i want to be right now well right now is why i want to be here but when this airs i want to be there get it because i'll be in some dry clothes mama i knew i should have brought a pair of x's scooby-doo underwear I love you guys.